This is the TV44 High School Whiz Quiz with your host, Dancy Moeller. Well, hello everyone and welcome to TV44's High School Whiz Quiz. Yes, indeed, we have four great teams lined up for you for tonight's show. First off, you're going to see New Knoxville take on Lincoln View. And a little bit later, Ada will face off against Allen East. We have both teams ready to go right now, and we're going to introduce you to them in just a minute. But I do want to tell you that if there are any questions during the show about any of the questions, we will turn to our judge, Mark Dickman, who is back again this year. All right, we're going to introduce you now to Lincoln View players. Joining us, we have Dylan Neat, Briggs Thatcher, Lauren Leatherman, and Max Rice. And Lincoln View is coached by Deb Stetler. Welcome to all of you. Thank you. All right, turning now to New Knoxville. Joining us is Sean Quigley, Rachel Hawkins, Jake Blitch, and Tristan Thompson. And New Knoxville is coached by Corey Cannon. Welcome to all of you as well. All right, we have our first round here. Ten questions worth ten points apiece. Let's get those buzzers ready. Please make sure you speak loudly and clearly, and just have fun with it, okay? All right, here we go, question number one. The Thinker is one of this artist's best known works. Yes, that would be Lincoln View. Um, David. David is incorrect, so New Knoxville, you can try this one. Yes. Michelangelo. That is also incorrect. The answer is August Rodin. All right, who was the Sioux chief at the Battle of Little Bighorn in 1876? Yes, New Knoxville. Crazy Horse. Crazy Horse is the answer. All right, question number three. Name the final commanding general of the Union Army in the Civil War. Lincoln View. Ulysses S. Grant. You are correct. Very good. All right. Question number four. What is the capital city of Scotland? Yes, New Knoxville. Scarborough. That is the incorrect answer. So Lincoln View, you want to try? No? <laughs> okay. <laughs> the answer here is Edinburgh. All right. Question five. Identify the economic system characterized by a free market. Lincoln View. Capitalism. Capitalism is the answer. All right, give the C word, meaning a fee paid to a broker for negotiating a sale. Yes, New Knoxville. A cut. Cut is incorrect. Lincoln View, is your try? Yes. Is it collateral? Collateral is also incorrect. The answer we're looking for is commission. All right, question number seven. Name the Soviet satellite launched in 1957. Yes, Lincoln View. Sputnik. Sputnik is the answer. What American clergyman wrote Sinners in the Hands of an Angry God? All right, time's up, teams. The answer is Jonathan Edwards. All right, two questions remain in your round one. In Jewish tradition, name the festival that celebrates the exodus from Egypt. Yes, New Knoxville. Passover. Passover is correct. And your final question, round one. What is the name for a pardon granted by a government for political offenders? Yes, New Knoxville. Asylum. Asylum is incorrect. So, Lincoln View, you want to try? Amnesty. Amnesty is the answer there. All right, very good. We've come to the end of round one. Here's our score right now. Lincoln View, you have 40 points. New Knoxville, 20. We'll be back with rounds two and three right after this. Tonight's Whiz Quiz Contests are brought to you by The Union Bank Company, 
committed to you. By the Tom All family of dealerships, Chrysler, Buick, Dodge, and Hyundai, the home of a knock your socks off deal. And by QB Hamburgers, a taste of Lima since 1928. All right, welcome back everyone. We are entering rounds two and three of our game right now between Lincoln View and New Knoxville. Here's the score. Lincoln View, you have 40 points. New Knoxville with 20. That means Lincoln View, you will start round two with five questions worth five points apiece. And please ring in with your buzzer, okay? All right, number one, what color journalism is inflammatory and irresponsible reporting? Yes. Yellow. Yellow is correct. All right. What queen presided over England during the Renaissance? <laughs> Time is up. The answer is Elizabeth the first. All right. Name the U.S. songwriter that wrote, This Land is Your Land. Right, time's up. The answer is Woody Guthrie. All right, two questions remain. What mathematician is credited to have said Eureka as he stepped into his bath? Yes. Newton. Newton is incorrect. The answer is Archimedes. All right, your final question. Give another name for the constellation the Great Bear. Yes. Ursa Major. Ursa Major is correct. Okay, moving over to New Knoxville now for your five questions. Everybody ready? After World War II, what plan gave large amounts of economic aid to Europe? Potsdam. Potsdam. Yes. Potsdam Conference. That's incorrect. The answer is Marshall Plan. All right, name the famous street in Manhattan that passes through Times Square. Yes. Wall Street. Wall Street is incorrect. It would be Broadway that we're looking for. All right, what 20th century Mexican painter was known for his murals? Okay, the answer is Diego Rivera. Two questions remain in your second round. Who wrote the tragedy, Oedipus Rex? Oh, uh, Stan Linsky. Yes. Stan Linsky. That is incorrect. Oh, Sophocles is what we're looking for. All right, last question here. Legally turning out a tenant is called what E word? Yes. Evicting. Evicting is correct. Okay. We've come to the end of rounds one and two. Our score right now, Lincoln View, 50 points. New Knoxville, you have 25. Moving into our final round, this again, 10 questions worth 10 points apiece, all up for grabs. All right, the ureters, urethra, and bladder are a part of what system? Yes, that would be Lincoln View. Urinary. Could you expand your answer for me? Excretory. I'm sorry, we can't take that answer, so we can turn it over to New Knoxville. Yes. Urinary tract. The urinary tract is what we're looking for. All right. Number two, what is the rope-like structure that connects an embryo to the placenta? Yes, that'd be New Knoxville. Umbilical cord. Umbilical cord is correct. Name the capital of Greece. Yes, Lincoln View. Athens. Athens is correct. In music, what R word means a mass for a dead person? Yes, Lincoln View. Rest. Rest is incorrect. New Knoxville, do you want to try it? No. Okay, the answer is requiem. All right, number five. Who was the Prime Minister of Israel from 1969 to 
time is up. The answer is Golda Meir. Number six, who writes a daily article in a newspaper giving his or her opinion? Yes, that would be Lincoln View. The editor? The editor is correct. In ancient Rome, what was the outer garment worn by men? Yes, Lincoln View. A toga? Toga is correct. All right, three questions remain in your game here. John Calvin, Martin Luther, and John Knox were a part of what movement? New Knoxville. The Protestant Reformation. That is correct, the Reformation. What is an order of the court compelling a witness to be present at a trial? Yes, that'd be a Lincoln View. A warrant? A warrant is incorrect. New Knoxville, do you want to try? Yes. Subpoena. Subpoena is the answer. And your final question in your game. What city in Morocco was the setting of a classic movie starring Humphrey Bogart? Yes, Lincoln View. Casablanca. Casablanca is the answer. All right, we've come to the end of our game between Lincoln View and New Knoxville, and here is the score. New Knoxville, 65 points. Lincoln View, you'll be moving on with 90 points. Congratulations, and New Knoxville, thank you for joining us this year. We'll be back with our second game right after the break. Tonight's Wiz Quiz Contests are brought to you by The Union Bank Company, committed to you. By the Tom All family of dealerships, Chrysler, Buick, Dodge, and Hyundai, the home of a knock-your-socks-off deal. And by QB Hamburgers, the taste of Lima since 1928. All right, welcome back to Wiz Quiz, everyone. We're just about ready to start a new game, but I want to tell you the score of our previous game between New Knoxville and Lincoln View. Right there, New Knoxville was 65 points, and Lincoln View came up the winner with 90 points. They'll be moving on to face the winner of this game between Ada and Allen East. We want to introduce you to our players. Joining us from Ada High School, we have Chandler Hugert, Ben Bowers, Noah Pinckney, and Alex Hurdig. And Ada is coached by Dave Lusk. Welcome to you gentlemen. All right, turning now to Allen East. Joining us is Lucas Kuhn, Evan Stover, Sarah Plogger, and Dakota Clark. Allen East is coached by Clay Casey. Welcome to all of you. All right, here we go with round one. 10 questions, 10 points apiece. Let's get those buzzers ready. It's really important that you speak loudly and clearly and make your answers as complete as possible. Here we go. What color term is used to describe stocks of high quality? Pink stocks. Ada. Blue. We will take that. Blue chip stocks. All right, number two. Identify the number that appears on the top of a fraction in mathematics. Ada. The numerator. Numerator is correct. What is a source that can be replenished naturally in the course? Yes, that would be Ada. A renewable resource. That is the correct answer. All right, name the complex chemical that gives plants their green color. Ada. All right, we're going to turn it over to Alan East. Yes. Chlorophyll. Chlorophyll is the answer. Name the exchange of goods or services for other goods or services. Buzzer, buzzer. Okay, go ahead. Barter. Barter is correct. All right, question number six. What author was jailed because he would not pay a tax to support the Mexican War? Hugo Chavez. <laughs> All right, time is up, teams. The answer is Henry David Thoreau. Oh, All right, moving on, number seven. In what town did Jesus grow up? Yes, Beth Ada. Bethlehem. Bethlehem is incorrect. Alan East, do you want to try? Yeah, I know, I know. Yes. Jerusalem. 
Jerusalem is also incorrect. Nazareth. The answer is Nazareth. Okay. Yep. All right. Question number eight. Who was the Roman god of sleep and dreams? All right, the answer is Morpheus. Two questions remaining in round one. Name the type of religious song that was originated by black Americans. Yes, Ellen East. Him? Him is incorrect. Ada, you want to try? Yeah, yeah. Yes. Gospel? Gospel is also incorrect. The answer is spiritual. Oh. All right, your final question in round one. What is the second largest major planet? Ada. Saturn. Saturn is correct. <laughs> All right, we've one. come to the end of round one. Yeah, Our Saturn. score That's right now. Ada, you have 50 points. Alan East, you have 10. Ada, that means you lead this next round. You have five questions with five points apiece. They're all yours, but please make sure to still buzz in, okay? okay. Here we go. Name the British Prime Minister elected in 1980. Uh, uh, who's, who's the lady one? Uh, who's the lady one? Time is up, and I heard it mentioned. It's, it's Margaret, Margaret Thatcher. Thatcher. Dang it. All right, number one? two. I don't know her name. <laughs> in what country did the Olympic Games originate? Yes. Greece. Greece is correct. What Aztec emperor was overthrown Montezuma. by conquistadors Montezuma. under yeah. Cortez? Yes. Montezuma. Montezuma That's is it. correct. Name the three wars between ancient Carthage and Rome from 246 BC uh, to 146 no. BC. No, not Phoenician. Um, Carthaginian. I don't know. It's okay, it's Carthaginian. Good try it. Carthaginian. That is incorrect. The answer is the Punic Wars. Oh. Okay. All right. We've got a vocal group over here. All right. Question five in your second round. What is the doctrine in Christianity that there are three divine persons in one God? Yes. Holy Trinity, the Holy Trinity. The Trinity is correct. Okay, <laughs> moving over to the quiet Alan East. All right, you ready? Identify a famous collection of Persian folk tales, which includes characters like Aladdin, Ali Baba, and Sinbad the Sailor. Do you know your Arabian novels? No. Time is up. I heard part of the answer. The Arabian Nights. Oh. All right. <laughs> Name the sacred book of Islam. The yes. Quran? The Quran is correct. What is the French festival that takes place the day before Lent? Yes. Uh, the festival of love. That is incorrect. The answer is Mardi Gras. All right, what Protestant denomination is organized in military fashion? The answer is the Salvation Army. And your final question in round two. Who was U.S. President from 1945 to 1953? Yes. Uh, Truman. That is correct, Harry Truman. All right, our score right now, Ada, 65 points. Alan East with 20. We'll be back to wrap up the game right after the break. Tonight's Wiz Quiz contests are brought to you by the Union Bank Company, committed to you. By the Tom All family of dealerships, Chrysler, Buick, Dodge, and Hyundai, a home of a knock-your-socks-off deal. And by QP Hamburgers, a taste of Lima since 1928. All right, we're moving into our final round of questions between Ada and Allen East High Schools. Here's our score right now, if we could have that. We have Ada with 65 points. Alan East with 20. All right, this round again, 10 questions. We're 10 points apiece. Let's get the buzzers ready, and here we go. Name the two youngest men to serve as U.S. presidents. Yes, Ada. 
Kennedy and Roosevelt. That is correct. Oh. All right, moving on, number two. What river runs west from Pittsburgh to the Mississippi River? Yes, that would be Ada. Oh, crap. Uh, the Allegheny. <laughs> that is incorrect. No. Alan East, it's your chance to try this one. Yes. The Ohio River. Ohio River is the answer. Identify the U.S. city that is known as the gateway to the west. Ada. St. Louis. St. Louis is correct. Mm. What is the branch of physics dealing with light? Ada? Oh, electromagnetism. That is incorrect. So, Ellen East, you got a chance here. You gotta deal with light. Not specific. Okay, the answer is optics. Oh. Question number five. The mantle is the part that overlies which part of the earth? Ada. The core? The core is the answer. Name the large, upright, carnivorous dinosaur. Yes, Ada. Tyrannosaurus rex. You are correct. All right, <laughs> moving on. Question number seven. What is the symbol for prescriptions? Mm. Ada? An Rx or... Right, okay. Rx is correct. Okay, awesome. All right, you have three questions remaining in your game. What half of the brain is responsible for artistic functions? Yes. Left brain? Left brain is no, incorrect. No, Alan East? Like, yes. Right. right side of the brain is the answer there. The Question number nine. How is this wrong? Who is the most influential 20th century painter originating cubism? Picasso, Picasso. Yes, Ada. Picasso? Could you expand the name? Pablo Picasso? Pablo Picasso is correct. And your final question in this game, name the main sentence in a paragraph. Ada. Thesis. Thesis is incorrect. Alan East, do you want to try? Yes. The topic sentence. Topic sentence is the answer. All right, we've come to the end of our game between Allen East and Ada High School. Here is the score. Allen East, you have 50 points. Ada, 125. Congratulations, you're going to be moving on in competition. Allen East, we want to thank you for joining us this year. And we want to thank you at home for watching. We will see you back here next week. Until then, everyone, have a great one. Bye-bye.